Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. In today's video, let's talk about debugging or handling an error. By the way, this video is just for the beginners, but the expert are still welcome. This is our sample guys, and what we are going to do now is to create a code for this. Just like this, it will move to other records. So now let's start. So click that one, on click event, choose code builder. So normally guys, when we create a code for this, we just type like this, do cmd, go to record, and this one, next. And that's it. Okay. So let's try. So record number two, record number three, number four, and the last. Okay. There's a runtime error 2105 and then the description is you can't go to the specified record. By the way, if you are the only one using your system, then it's okay. You can just click this end and there's nothing happening to your system. It cannot appeal to the um, functionality of your system. But, but, but if your system is a multi-user database, then you need to fix this error. You need to debug this error. How to do it? Just click this debug. And then, let's type something. This one. Since this is an error, let's type, let's type on error. This is the first option, guys. On error, resume next. Okay, that one. And it's close. So, let's try. Okay. When we click this, next. So, there's no error uh, being popped up. So, it's working, guys. But what if you want to have a message? When you click this, and there's a message. So, all you have to do, guys, is to use the go to. So, on error, just type go to. Let's type something error 1. It's up to you guys what do you call your error. So, so since this is error 1, just type here error 1 and then colon. Okay. So, for example, there's a message. That was the last record. Okay. So let's try. Record number two. There's a message that was the last record. So ideally, we don't want that. Okay. Record number three. Number four. Okay. So we have something missing. We will put exit sub. Meaning to say, after running this line, it will exit. It will stop. It will not um, push through in this line. So let's try. Okay, next record 2, 3, 4. The last, that was the last record. So, what if you don't like that re uh, message? You want the system error to be applied. So, all you have to do, replace this to error. So, that description. Okay. So, let's try. When you click this one, you can't go to the specified record. So, okay. Click. And last. Okay. So, there's no more error, guys. And if you want to learn more about Microsoft Access, then consider subscribing this channel for more informative videos. That's all. Thank you. And see you to my next video.